Hi, it's my time to shine. I'm just doing a general read for the sign of the Pisces. This is a timeless read. So whenever you get to it, it's meant for you. It's not going to resonate for every Pisces, but I tune into majority of Pisces. You're going to take what resonates, you're going to need the rest. This is like a, a, a quick read. Let's see what's going on with my Pisces. I'm using my Illuminati tarot deck, if you can see. And I'm going to be using, using my Gordon, my Morgan Greer deck. Which is usually that way. And I'm going to be using my Angel Whispers as oracles for this read. Universe, Spirit, God, please let me read these readings accurately, efficiently, and quickly. And you, I trust, as always. Amen. What's the overall energy of my Pisces? The star. Something you wish and hope for. It's the overall energy, which is Aquarius energy. So let's see. One foot in, one foot out. I take this card as also when you got one foot to the divine and one foot out of the divine. That's where you at, like a crossroad of trying to choose a path in life. That's how I take this card. Wow, that hit me. <laughs> it fell right on my heart. That was deep. Okay. Universe spirit guides. What surrounds Pisces energy at this moment? Hmm. What surrounds Pisces energy at the moment? What surrounds Pisces energy at the moment? What's around Pisces energy at the moment? No, that goes there. Sorry, Bill. You go here. And you go here. Put my glasses on. I can't wait to get my other new glasses tomorrow. Yes. I then ordered me another pair of Gucci glasses. Um, what's around? That's too many cards. What's around Pisces energy at this moment? <clears throat> Excuse me. Okay. Your overall energy is the two of Pentacles, trying to stay balanced and um, above water. <clears throat> or you could be juggling. That's here to tell. You have the seven of swords reverse. You coming out of getting away with something or somebody else's. You have the nine of wands. You're trying to make something happen and you like moving way in front. Like you getting that shit done. You could be dealing with a Leo, Sagittarius or Aries. Or that could be just your energy getting shit done. You got the king of pentacles. This could be your energy, or you could be dealing with a Capricorn, Taurus, or Virgo. You have the Five of Wands. There's confusion, commotion. It's a, it's like a crowd maybe around you in some type, some type of matter. Or this also could be competition that you may see as just regular 
things around you, but it's really competition. Or you could be at some type of competition event where, like, you going against people in some type of event. It could also mean that, like, you take what resonates and you can lead the rest. You also got the chariot. You moving fast towards something. But you got the nine of pentacles reverse. So you coming up out of, you know, having some things in order. Or maybe you coming up out of moving fast towards a Capricorn, Virgo, or Taurus. Your future, you got the Ten of Pentacles. Mm, excuse me. The Ten of Swords represents some type of painful ending. Represent clarity and truth in some type of situation. You have the Six of Pentacles. Basically, you're trying to balance out the situation amongst two people. Or you could be given. Donating, or somebody could be donating to you. You got the sun, though. Straight to happiness, to abundance. So, it's like you getting out of a situation where you used to try to get away with some shit. That's what I'm saying. Or, if it's not you, somebody was, somebody was getting away with some shit you ain't know. And they coming out of that energy because they see that you the nine of wands. You make shit happen no matter what they trying to do to you. And you went straight to King of Pentacles. Like, you're not really trying to hear all that about nothing because you make shit happen. Like, you make your money happen. You make your own money. So, like, it's a lot of confusion around you. You may not see. Or I could take this as you in some type of competition. as a competition that you want to be in. Or maybe it's a competition you don't. But I see you move fast away from this if it's confusion. And you, you know, coming up out of worrying about Pentacles so much because you okay. Um, because even if you got the, you're the king of pentacles and you went down to the nine coming up out of the nine of pentacles, you still got some type of pentacles left, or you could be moving fast towards this Capricorn, Taurus or Virgo, or you coming out of trying to move fast towards them in a situation, whatever resonate, but it's a painful ending. And I don't know, it's because you coming out of this energy of a nine of pentacles with a Capricorn, Taurus or Virgo. But whatever happened, you still balancing and you still like sharing. This is sharing and caring in the situation. Or you could be dealing with a Capricorn, Taurus, or Virgo. And you go straight to happiness. You could be dealing with a Leo or in their energy and you still trying to balance something. But I want to do a clarifier because I want to see. I want to go all the way back to somebody coming out or trying to do something. Like, I want to know what that's about. What, what, what somebody was trying to do was that you or somebody else was trying to sabotage some shit you had going on. What's the energy around my Pisces? Okay. Okay, you got the King of Cups. Your emotions isn't all in order. This is a Pisces, Scorpio, Cancer. So, I will, whoever tried to... Somebody was coming up out of trying to get away with something. And I guess you may already knew it. Because you kept your emotions intact during this situation. So, maybe it was another sign. Water sign such as yourself. A Scorpio, Pisces, a Cancer that was trying to get away with something. And that's why you was looking the other way. But you knew. That's what I'm saying, you know. Or it was a Gemini, Libra, Aquarius. They coming up out of trying to get away with something because you the king of cups. You know how to keep your emotions and wraps and just deal with a situation. And you just looked ahead is what I'm seeing. Let me see what this nine of wands is about. Making something happen. What's the energy surrounding Pisces at this time? Okay, yeah, you feel defeated in a situation. Like, not defeated, but they feel defeated. Like, it's like one person praying. It's like the other one is talking to the divine. It's like they gave up. Like, this is my gave up card. Like, they gave up on trying to get away with something with you. They gave up on trying to make something happen towards you like basically they can't beat you when they try so they just gave in like 
It wasn't like you fully won. They just gave up. Like, that was it. I'm going to see what energy surrounds this Pisces at the moment. What energy surrounds this Pisces at the moment? What energy surrounds this Pisces at the moment? You got the Queen of Cups. So you got the King and you got the Queen of Cups. So the King looking one way, the Queen looking the other. So, hmm, this is funny. It's like, it's like you, this queen is looking at this king. Maybe this queen is looking at this king because she's seen everything that you went through in the past. How people was trying to do so much to you and you still stayed with your emotions. You didn't come out of character and you, and you maintain balance and they just gave up so maybe this queen is seeing this you could be dealing with a scorpio cancer or pisces such as yourself or this is just your energy because we got feminine and, and, and we got male energy in all of us so baby you you look in the front of you and you look in the back of you like you got double eyes you see everything even though you don't got eyes at the back of your head is what i'm seeing i'm gonna go ahead and i'm gonna clarify this five and ones this confusion or competition or or this conflict. What energy is the Pisces in? What's mm. what's around the Pisces energy at this time? Mm. Came out sideways and you got it twice. Like Pisces, like I fucks with y'all. But I got to keep something real with you. You got somebody around you that's wishing for a painful ending. And this is swords. This could also be a Gemini, Libra, Aquarius. Like, yo, somebody can't stand you. Like, it is just so, like, fucked up to say. Like, at, at, at the end of the day, like, Pisces, Capricorns, Pisces, Capricorns, Libras and Sagittarius. We always got motherfuckers that be trying to take us out of here, yo, in any type of fucking way. And when I mean taking us out, like, for me, a Capricorn, somebody tried to poison my food and shit, a nigga, and it came out when, when I had a heart attack and shit, right? I know Sagittarius that be getting shot at all the time. I even lost one. I know Pisces that almost died a couple times or they always going through some painful shit like far as somebody trying to fuck with them in some ways, yo. Like, you got this right now for what is this conflict? Like, it's a painful fucking ending for you in your present, right? And then I didn't get to your future yet, but the first card of your future is the double ten of swords in your back bleed. And like, somebody is so shisty around you, you don't even know, yo. Like, it's fucked up, and I feel bad because, like, my favorite cousin is a Pisces, and they, he been try, they been trying to kill him over and over and over and over again. He would change his life. But this is just it. Like, it's a painful ending in something, my nigga, or my girl. It's a painful ending because, like, it's just, it's two, two, two ten, first of all, tens is a closing of one cycle to begin anew. One plus zero is one is a new beginning, but is it a new beginning in another lifetime for you because like, I keep shit real and I know what these cards be meaning. I don't like this shit. Like somebody is hating on you, my nigga. They hating on you real, 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 real bad. And you don't understand it. And it's conflict, but you don't see this conflict because it's internal. You feel what I'm saying? Like, in other words, people can hate you and keep it inside of them. So you won't, you're not going to see this conflict. They coming at you and other people. This is somebody, this is somebody inside. They is mad as shit. They hating on you. They, they wish for a painful end and they wish you no longer be here no longer. Bottom fucking line. Now, are they going to take action towards it? Yeah, if they could get away with it. But I don't think they're going to take action with it. This is how somebody feel like they like wish you not wasn't here no more. Like you is just taking a line, the spotlight. You taking everything from somebody. 
And this may not be one person because this is a lot of people. This is like five different people, different types of signs. Like, they literally don't like you. It's like, fuck out of here. What that nigga just died? Or what that bitch just died? Like, that nigga corny. Or that nigga this. Like, that nigga think he got that money like that. That nigga broke. And that nigga this and this. Listen. You better listen to this motherfucker reading because at the end of the day, you got to pay for fucking ending. Now, you can switch these roles the fuck up by watching your motherfucking self. And I mean, watch yourself because I just had a reading for myself, my nigga. And uh, my reading was telling me that I need to be careful. Bottom fucking line, I got somebody, a man and a woman that's around me, where I reside at, that want don't want me here no longer. They wish death, they wish this, they they just sit and wish all types of shit, but they want to be me. And it's somebody that be smiling at me. That's what the fuck they told me. So I just got a spiritual healing over me at 12 midnight last night. Somebody don't want you around no more. They wish you was dead. That's how they feel, yo. Yeah. They feel like that about you, and that's some fucked up shit, but that's how these motherfuckers is, yo. They mad because you the king of pinnacles, and you know how to keep your shit balanced and your emotions in check. They don't like that shit, and they like, damn, this nigga right here is making shit happen, and you still, they, you, they still defeat, they try to defeat you, and they tired of trying to do the little slick shit on the side. You don't see it, though. This is all your past. And you and they coming out of doing slick shit because they realize they can't beat you. And your emotions still is set. It could be anything. Somebody around you don't like you. And they wishing bad things upon you. But you moving fast towards that shit. Away from it, something you moving fast towards Capricorn, Taurus, or Virgo, or moving fast towards your pinnacles. So you could build your pinnacles. Because you got the nine of pentacles reversed. And usually the nine of pentacles is close to the ten is when everything is just sweet and lovely. And things just not sweet and lovely right now. You might feel a certain vibe around you. That you can't, you just can't, you don't understand why you feel this way. You may feel a certain way. You might feel this. You got to feel this. If you're not feeling this, it's reading ain't for you. Or you acting like it ain't for you. But you got to feel this because this is sad. This is what they want you. They don't want you here. And you don't know if he dead or alive or he just pierced. But somebody is backstabbing you. Talking about you to somebody else or somebody somebody doing something. Now, in your future, once again, the Ten of Swords. A painful fucking ending. Like, I mean, it's sad as shit. Like, this is the future. Like, this is, this is, this is deep. I don't know. Like on some real shit, you need to come to me and get a and get a spiritual cleansing, because huh, I don't know what else to tell you besides talk to the divine, because he'll always show you a way out and show you who's really true around you that you think is true and ain't true, or it could be a friend of a friend, but somebody wants you out of here. They don't want. They don't want. They don't want to see you. They don't like you. They don't like you at all. And then you got the Six of Pentacles. They see you as loving, sharing, spreading the wealth. They see you giving. And they still hating. Like you giving to these motherfuckers. You feel what I'm saying? You got the Six of Pentacles. You literally giving to these people. And they still want to see you with both of these Ten of Swords like this. They still want to see you out of here. They don't want you here no more. And, 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 and that's it. And, and the way I'm going to put up this reading, you might be mad when you get it. Because I'm definitely going to send this to a few people that I fucks with heavy. They needs to know. They see you giving. You giving. You caring. Six of Pentacles. You like try to balance out shit. But at the end of the day, they don't care about none of that shit. All they, were, they're, all they focus is on is you not being here no longer. That's how motherfuckers is, yo. They shysty, yo. They don't care. You got the two of pentacles. They don't like it because you stay in balance, even through on water. You can still balance shit. They don't like that shit. Even if you off balance, you still on balance. Motherfuckers can't move like you. They don't like that. You could be dealing with a Capricorn, Taurus, or Virgo, and you in their energy. Because I stay balanced over the most waters. I don't go fuck if it's a hurricane. I'm still balanced. A lot of people can't do that. They don't like that. Then you got the sun. You go straight to happiness, though, though. Like, 
You could be dealing with Leah, or you just happy. They don't like that. They don't like this happiness here. They don't like you happy. They don't even want to. They don't want you here no more, my nigga. They just don't. They just they jealous. They hateful. They envy. With the with two tens of swords with painful endings and blood coming out your back. <sighs> this, this, this is not good. And this is all with people that you could be around. Or this could be friends of friends. This could be people that act like they cool and inside they not. They just like, man, fuck that nigga. Or they like, fuck that bitch. Oh, that bitch get hit by a car. I'm, I'm keeping that shit real. Or fuck her. She ain't all that. And da -da -da, and she live here. and Or she da -da, she 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 have to lie to me. Or I don't like that bitch. I don't care that bitch die. That's how these hoes talk. So these niggas, I, I be around them. They like, man, that nigga corny as hell. Like, that nigga need to get the fuck out of here. That nigga too much. That nigga need to be dealt with. All because you sharing and caring. And loyal and loving. And know how to balance your fucking money. They mad as hell. I'm trying to tell you, yo. I'm not even clarifying your motherfucking reading. Because that's how deep your reading was that. It's no clarification. Your clarification with your reading is... You got to open your eyes because something ain't right with your shit. You got people that they not they ain't looking for the best like that for you. They acting like they is. You got too many swords. Truth and clarity. You want to get truth about who I'm talking about. And I hope it ain't too motherfucking late because that's why I stay by myself. I don't care. I don't care. I grew up with motherfuckers. For 20 years and see how motherfuckers do motherfuckers. Motherfuckers want fucking reports. Fucking snitching. Motherfuckers mad because I'm fucking the livest bitch around. And they might have fucked with the livest bitch around. And, and the livest bitch around don't want to fuck with them no more. They mad. Or you fucking with the nigga with the most money around the way. And somebody end up hearing about it. Next thing you know, the bitches is mad. Like, uh-uh, how she fucking with him? Then she used to fuck with such and such. And then y'all starting to fuck around heavy like that. And motherfuckers start talking, start to get mad. Especially if you fucking with somebody that's on the same level as you. That they can't bring down. Oh, they going to hate. You got to be careful. That's why... I don't like to be sneaky, but I don't like everybody knowing who I'm messing with like that because they start be trying to throw, throw shit at them or they be being shicey because they mad because they wanted to fuck them. That's why I like, I, I, I like a person like, I used to be like, man, you can come over right now, but now, like, you can't do that. I gotta watch everything because I don't trust nobody that's around me as myself as a Capricorn. I don't trust nobody around me. You might say me hi and smiling and hey and all that, but I don't trust no fucking body and i'm gonna keep that a fucking trail with you don't you ever believe one thing that you think this capricorn over here this star here trust anybody i'll be around i look at everybody and deal with everybody with a long handle spoon i know how motherfuckers will backstab you i know how motherfuckers will get you killed for a hundred dollars i know how motherfuckers will get you lined up to get you robbed i know how motherfuckers will chill with you every day be fucking your baby dad or baby mom I fucks with none, and I'm staying that way unless you in real estate and we eye to eye. I'm going to get an overall energy read over your reading for you, Pisces, and I'm going to do a prayer. Boom. You got the Ten of Pentacles. You got everything you want. You got your castle. You got your queen. Or if you don't have a queen, you can get any type of queen you want. You got living a good life, and they don't like this shit. They want you to be out of here. They want a painful ending. But with the divine, that shit going back to them. I'm going to say a prayer to you because you need this prayer because it is a serious serious offense and you got a lot going on and i'm going to say for real divine power of protection you that protect all those that need it i ask you that all evil caused to this pisces may be immediately reverted to those who wish them wrong that their bad wishes and thoughts never reach them Bless and protect their home, their work, and their family. In the Holy Father, I pray and Mother. Amen. And this going out directly to the Pisces bottom line.
because something is around you that is not authentic or somebody's plotting on you and you might not know it and it may not even be nobody that's around your surroundings it may be coming from another way but i'm gonna hope the best for you your reading was very long and it was very exhausting and i just pray and i hope that the divine power will protect you in your daily's life i hope that he opened your third eye so you could see things for what they really are and not be blind by other aspects or thinking because you may know a person or that person is cool with this person that person that this won't affect you in this day and age when people come at you, they always come at a curved way. They never come directly. They will use somebody to get to you. And the person that's being used won't know that they be a setup in the setup because their third eye is not open to see this snake. So all I'm going to tell you is open your eyes, be more on point, and be more alone as well so the divine could come into your life and open your heart and your solar plex chakra so you will be able to see the snakes before the snakes could touch your life. Peace, light, and blessings to all.